क्वेश्चन सिक्स सेज इट इज गिवन दैट एंगल एक्स वाई जेड इज इक्वल टू सिक्सटी फोर डिग्रीज एंड एक्स वाई इज प्रोड्यूस्ड टू पॉइंट पी ड्रॉ अ फिगर फ्रॉम द गिवन इन्फॉर्मेशन सो लेट्स ड्रॉ अ फिगर वेयर वी हैव एंगल एक्स वाई जेड इक्वल टू सिक्सटी फोर डिग्री सो आई ड्रॉन दिस फिगर फॉर यू हेयर एंगल एक्स वाई जेड इज सिक्सटी फोर डिग्रीज दिस एंगल हेयर एंड एक्स वाई एक्स वाई इज प्रोड्यूस्ड टू दिस पॉइंट पी Now the question for this is if ray yq bisects angle zyp so angle zyp is this angle here and we have to draw a ray that bisects this angle so here i have drawn a ray yq that bisects angle zyp then we have to find angle xyq and reflex angle qyp so let's highlight both of these angles so angle xyq is this angle angle xyq and reflex angle qyp is this angle qy qyp this angle this reflex angle so these are the two angles that we have to find so the way we can solve this problem is we can find this angle zyq and this angle qyp these two angles and both of these angles are half of angle zyp because yq is the bisector of angle zyp so let's find angle zyp first uh, and to do that we make use of the fact that angle x y z plus angle zyp this sum must be equal to 180 degrees because these two angles form a linear pair of angles and just to be sure that you you can visualize which two angles i'm talking about so one angle is this angle angle x y z and the other angle i'm talking about is this angle angle z y p so these are the two angles that sum to 180 degree now x y z is known so x y z is 64 degrees so 64 degrees plus angle z y p this is equal to 180 degrees and from here we can find angle z y p this is equal to 180 degrees minus 64 degrees that's 116 degrees so angle zyp is equal to 116 degrees and now this means that we can find um angle zyq this angle and angle qyp this angle because both of these are half of angle zyp so let's write it here angle zyq and angle q y p both of these are half of um 116 degree because both of these are half of angle z y p half of 116 degrees is um 58 degrees so both of these angles are equal to 58 degrees so let's write it here 58 degrees and 58 degrees now it's easy to find the two angles that we have to find angle x y q and reflex angle q y p so angle x yq is uh this angle that i highlighted earlier this angle this is nothing but this sum of xyz and zyq so angle xyz plus angle zyq and this is equal to 64 degree plus 58 degrees and that's equal to 122 degrees so that's the measure of angle xyq and we can also find reflex angle qyp which which is simply 360 degrees minus angle qyp because the sum of angles at a point is 360 so to find the reflex angle we just um, subtract from 360 degree we subtract the normal angle so we have 360 degrees minus what is qyp so qyp is also 58 degrees so 360 degrees minus 58 degrees um this is equal to 302 degrees so the answer to question 6 is that angle xyq has a measure of 122 degrees and angle qyp reflex has a measure of 302 degrees with that we have solved question 6 to learn more about how qmath can help you crack school and board exams explore qmath leap a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers